everybody, this is Schwan, and just letting you guys know that this video was sponsored by LockoutGaming.net, ClanInfectionist.com, and FTGRadio.blogspot.com, the best gaming podcast. Hello everybody, and welcome to my video tutorial of how to edit audio basic in Sony Vegas 8. So let's get started here. Now, let's say you're a host of a podcast like I am, called Free to Game Radio, and one of your members, or you, cursed while in the podcast. And that's not good, because you don't want iTunes to give you bad, f like, an explicit tag. So, what you want to do is, if someone cursed, you don't want to redo the whole segment that you guys were talking about. You just want to edit out their curse word. And what you do is you go into Vegas, and I made a little clip right here, and here, I'll let you guys hear it. Curse word. Now, see, I just curse, so now, but I'm going to keep talking, so now, I got to fix that curse word to keep this audio message clean. Okay, I hope you heard that, and if you could tell, I said curse word, and that's where I'm going to insert the curse word, or <laughs> the sound effect that will cover up the curse word. So, I'm going to zoom in, and you can either do that by clicking on this little zoom in button right here, okay, or you could zoom in by using your mouse wheel, alright, and wherever this um, thing is, I don't know what you call it actually, but wherever that little tracer, I'll call it a tracer is, that's where you're going to, like, when I zoom in, it goes to the tracer. So, have the tracer about where you want to zoom in at. Alright, so now, let's, we got to figure out what... Which one of these scrambly lines did I say curse word in? So here we go. Curse word. Okay, so then I, I said curse word and then I stopped it. Alright, so now I don't want that in there anymore because that was a really bad explicit curse word I said. So I'm going to press the S button where this tracker is. Okay, and that'll split it. So now there's two different sections. This section is the curse word. And this section is when I kept talking. So now what I want to do is, I want to cover up this curse word. So, one good place to go to find cover-ups that I like to use is the Mushroom Kingdom. Okay, and what you do in the Mushroom Kingdom is, it's the mushroomkingdom.net. Go down to Downloads, Sounds and Music, MP3s, and then here's a whole bunch of Mario sound effects from different games. Uh, and, okay. Back to Vegas. Um, now that I have my cover up, which is going to be Mario going down a pipe in Super Mario Brothers, and see how that's not long enough to cover up the whole curse word? I'm just going to drag it out. So now, now it's long enough. But if you notice, do you see those little indents in there? An indent there. That means that when it gets to that point, the track is going to repeat. And that's okay for now, but don't do that like when you're talking or anything. Just for this little pipe sound, it's really not going to make a difference. Alright, so we want to delete this curse word and drag the pipe sound in instead. And drag that close together. Now, let's hear our newly revised podcast. Now, see, I just curse, so now, but I'm going to keep talking. So now, i got to fix that curse word to keep this audio message clean. Okay, now if you heard that, that was complete success. It was the pipe sound, and it had nothing to do with the curse word. So, now our podcast is clean. But if you noticed, my silly co-host messed up. He said something twice, and it sounded all gibberish and whatever. So, we gotta find that part where I, or I mean, my silly co-host repeated his words. Alright, let's see. Now see, I just curse, so now, but I'm gonna keep talking. Alright, did you hear that? He said, so now, I just repeated my curse word, so now I'm just going to keep talking. That's ridiculous. What? Why would he say that? So, let's get a little more in depth, in depth here. Well, I have, a, I have a little bit of a lisp here. Alright. Now, see, I just curse, so now... Now, okay, that's where it stopped, right there. So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to grab it right above the tracker, and I'm going to... Ah, damn it. And I'm going to move it. Do do do. All right, I'm gonna move it right there. So my highlighted area is where my silly co-host messed up talking. <laughs> so I'm gonna press the delete button. Okay. Now let's hear it. Let's just start it from the pipe sound again. 
but I'm going to keep talking. So now I got to fix that curse word to keep this audio message clean. Okay, now that sounds really good. See, I didn't, I didn't, I mean, my silly co-host didn't jumble up his words there. But if you notice, right here, hold on. To keep this audio message clean. That was kind of weird, wasn't it? There was like a really big pause, and then I said my word. Um, you don't have to edit that. Um, that's really overdoing it, but if you would like to, obviously that line where nothing is going on is when nothing was going on. So grab above it. Take your little slider, press the delete button, take the segment, put it back. So now when you listen to it, this audio message clean. There's no wait time. And that's a good thing. So now we have our podcast. It's roughly five seconds long. And I wanna make a um I wanna make an intro music for our podcast, because every good podcast needs intro music. Alright. So let's use, for example, um, what should we use? All right, we'll use the song from Portal, Still Alive. Okay. Now, you see how long the song is? We don't want it that long, obviously. So we're going to grab the end, and we're going to drag it all the way back. All right, so now, right there. Okay, I like to do that. You could do it up here, I guess. That's probably better. Um, all right. So now, uh, okay, so now I'm going to teach you how to fade in and fade out audio. So what you want to do is you want to grab this corner right here, and you want to drag it, and that little white line right there shows you how much it's going to fade in. So I'm going to put the line there, and I'm going to fade out, okay, so I'm going to put the line there. And here's what that's going to sound like. Okay, and did you notice how it faded in, it got real loud, and then it faded out. And that's perfect, that's exactly what we want. And that you also use that technique when you're combining, see these two segments I have? You want them to go together smooth, so what you do is you drag them together, and it creates um, those fade in, fade outs, so it sounds a lot cleaner. And that's my end of my tutorial, that's the end of my basic editing in Sony Vegas 8, so hope this helps you a little bit, and if you have any questions, um, send me a YouTube message.